Hey Spice Squad, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, press that red subscribe button down below and become a part of the squad and press the bell so you don't miss a thing your girl posts. What's going on Spice Squad? So I am here today with another great video. This should be a fun video. Y'all about to get all up in my business for real. Like if you want to know a girl, go through her purse. Well, somebody that's a purse person, because I am a purse person. Like, I need a purse, a bag, something, wherever I go. Like, I can't just take my ID and my debit card and be fine. Like, I always need some type of bag. I'm always the person that's going to have a, a bag wherever we go. Like, if we're going out, I'm going to be the one that has the bag when we go out. And it'll be like a crossbody bag, a clutch or something. Something to hold my stuff. I know a lot of people who are not bag people and don't carry purses. And my sister is one of them. Like, she never has a bag. Anyway. I am going to show you one of my everyday bags, one of my bags that I wear, I can wear with anything and I just love it so much and it's the long, the bag I had the longest, this is the bag I had the longest, this was my first designer bag, my Louis Vuitton checker bag, check the initials, you see it, <laughs> no this was one of my, this is my first designer bag I ever got, I had it for years and I can just say it's held up very nicely, there's like no scratches, like it looks new. The inside doesn't all the way look new if you like were really here and seen the bottom of it. But I love big bags. I love big bags. Heart big bags. I have a lot of small bags, but I love big bags because I always have so much stuff. I don't know why, but I'm like, if you ever need something, I have it in my bag. You just better hope I have my big bag. And all my friends, family members, or anybody, if I say, hey, can you grab me my, can you grab my bag and grab my purse? It's always heavy. It feels like a ton of bricks. Like I wish I thought about bringing my scaling her sock away, but like, can you can you tell like how heavy it is? Like I can't just swing this thing up here. Like it might look like I did, but I did it. Like it's heavy. Like listen to this. Listen to this. <laughs> like this y'all fool, and you can see. So I'm just about to go through my bag and let y'all know what I carry in my bag. And if you think that's normal or it's not normal, like let me know. But whatever. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to pull out, because it's right there, is this little bag inside my bag. And this holds my lip glosses for the most part. Like, not all my lip glosses, but a lot of my lip glosses. So, my color lip glosses, lipsticks, chapsticks. I keep some lip gloss with me. Scrunchy, a little scrunchy, or band. <laughs> Don't ask me, but today it was raining, so I had my umbrella. In here and I swear like I didn't just put this in here because this make my bag so heavy but it was raining this morning so I just grabbed it because it's on my door but that's not always in my bag that was just something that was in my bag today um this might seem ancient but my checkbook I haven't had to use many checks but you never know when you have to I had to use a check when I got my gate it was just old school I wrote a check but you never know when you need it so I keep it in my bag my wallet, this is my MCM wallet. I like big wallets because I have a lot of stuff. Like, I don't know why I just do. So, got some dollars in there. Have my cards, my debit cards, a couple credit cards, um, some change. I rarely have cash, so I'm surprised that I have this cash in here. Um, I have like my reward cards, like, to Saks Fifth, I have one. Um, I have one for Sephora, Alta, my insurance card. I have an AutoZone card. It comes in handy, okay? I love my wallet because it fits everything I need. I need a charging cord. Like everybody always like is carrying their charger cord with them. Whether they have a purse or not, I bet you they got an Apple charger with them. So, I have my Apple charger. Oh, I have this like badge ID. This is for one of the jobs that I can work at, like basically whenever I want. It's not everyone be familiar, but it's the port. It's in Delaware. And most places, a lot of places have ports, you know, where the big ships come in, like the cargo and like all the trucks and stuff. I can go there. I can you just go up there early in the morning, try to get picked. And a lot of times I do, you know, you know, my dad got connections. Like, it's like that, but if I want to go up there and work, I can and I like, I can easily make 18 to 20 dollars or more an hour green tea is my thing like if you follow my instagram and if you don't go down below follow my instagram it's my name niel underscore um green tea so i have some green tea in there and it's a couple packets in here 
I love this green tea. I don't put anything in my tea. I like it black. Okay, what else? I have some glasses. So I don't wear glasses on the regular, but sometimes at night when it's super dark or if it's like raining, I'll put them on. They have a tiny, tiny, tiny prescription in there. How do you guys like me with glasses? They look nerdy, they look cute, they look a little teacher. <laughs> Those are my glasses. They're like not name brand or anything, they're just regular black glasses and I really like that style. I have a little spray. Um, it's from Bath and Body Works called In the Stars. It smells good. But you never know when you need to freshen up really quick. Ch -ch -ch. About to go somewhere, about to see somebody. Spray up. Um, one of my notebooks. Uh, this is one of my notebooks that I write in for like keep my church notes, Bible study notes. And my thing is like I've had this book for forever and I do like write in it like all the time. But I still have pages left because I'll play, I love journals. I love journals. So if I get a new journal and it's super cute, I'm gonna like wanna use it and I'll like start taking some notes in it, even though I didn't finish one. And that explains this other journal that is in my bag that my mom got me. I love it. It says to my daughter and it has a beautiful, beautiful note on here. And yes, I'm like serious. Like I'll be writing in my notebooks. Like I have some notes right here already. So it's like I'll go back and forth, but now I'm getting really like OCD so I'm definitely finishing up this this pink book now I only have like a couple pages left and I'll be done with this and then I can definitely go full force into the one my mom got me that I love because I love like what it says and she really thought about me when she got it okay what else do I have in here I have my Wilmington University ID in here I graduated but I just have the ID I have I have airpods and we'll get to those but these are like my wire headphones which definitely came in handy when I got stuck in Chicago because I lost the other airpod and then my one airpod died and I lost the case so I needed headphones to listen to my phone so they were perfect to have and if you haven't seen that video make sure you go down below I'll put the link check it out it's crazy you won't believe what happened I have one of these blocks I call this a block the spray made me sneeze y'all so I have one of these blocks to go with my charger or any kind of USB B, USB B. What does USB B stand for? Not even try. Portable battery. United States. United States. I don't know what Um, I have some mace, pepper spray. You never know who might try it, especially for females. I think mace is something that you should keep on you. You just never know, and make sure it's handy. I have this is another lip balm it's like pure lease or whatever um still going through here y'all i'm telling y'all be having everything in here i have a android charger because i have a lot of things that like go to android chargers like my battery packs i have the dre beats um i have this like light thing that goes on my phone that like pop shines but they use pd chargers to charge um, I have a wet wipe. I love messy food, so they always come in handy. And then, like, I have godchildren, nieces and nephews. I be around a lot of kids, so wet wipes are necessary. Okay. If you know me and if you be around me, especially if you eat around me, you know I always got these on deck. Like, I need these. They, like, like pick your teeth with. I even have a couple loose ones. I'm forever like have to pick my teeth after I eat because I feel like it's something in my teeth. Like I have some type of phobia that I think that after I eat there's always something in my teeth. So I need to pick my teeth. And I'm getting that. I always, this is this MCM. I have this MCM tote bag too. Um, one of my favorite bags because I was like literally that's like more every day than this everyday bag. But I always use this pouch to just hold my little stuff in it because most of the totes don't have like another pocket inside besides the zippy so i put that in here to kind of keep some of my stuff together the stuff that i use like all the time so now i'm going through that i saved that for last because this has some of my key ingredients inside <laughs> so these have some two little pills they're the ibuprofen like 800s my mom gave me because i was having really bad headaches at one point but you can never go wrong with having them i have a motrin bottle too i literally just took all of them yesterday so i have to re-up i love motrin it's one of my favorites like to use for headaches and pain and stuff like that um 
As a girl, I do have some tampons. You can never be sure. You never know when you need it or when a fellow sister needs it. Oh, I have some tickets to the Wells Fargo Center. I'm taking one of my favorite little guys to the Jurassic World. So, I have this in here. So, I don't lose track of that. Um, oh, I have a Remind Me card for my OBGYN appointment. March 12th. Gotta keep it right and clean. I have some hand lotion. I feel like everyone always asks me for hand lotion. I always have hand lotion on deck and hand sanitizer. Bath and Body Works. And y'all, what's my favorite condiment? What do I put on everything? You can answer this question. Like, what do I put on everything? You already know hot sauce. So I have my hot sauce package with me. I love Chick Fil A. Chick Fil A and Chipotle are my favorite fast food restaurants. I don't even really feel like they fast food restaurants for real. Like. They're not. And Chick-fil-A does me right because they use Texas Pete hot sauce and that's my favorite brand. That's all I have in my house and all I'll ever have in my house and that's all I eat. But I mean, if it's no other hot sauce and it's like Frank's or Crystal like Louisiana, I'll use it. But this is my favorite. Gotta keep them on deck. I have a little mirror. It's real ghetto because it broke, but it does the job. I can see myself and it gets the job done. Oh. And then I have a lot of loose lip glosses and chapsticks. Like, you can just never have enough. And since I use them all the time, I don't always put them in the bag, which I should because that'll just keep everything neater. But I be just trying to get to it real fast. I might be driving, I reach over my bag, grab it, too. But if I got this, the little pouch and the zipper and all that, it's just a bit much. So, yeah. Stuff falling off. More hand sanitizer, clean freak, wanna be clean, not trying to get sick out here in these streets. A clip, because you never know you need to clip your hair back. Pen, need a pen. If I, How can I have a journal and all this with no pen? Pen, more lip gloss. AirPods, Band-Aid, first aid kit, safety first. Another pen. More lip balm. This is embarrassing. I need to put my lip balms and my lipsticks in the little pouch. Almost fell off. Lash brushes to brush my lashes. They're not on right now, so um, don't judge me. Appointment's coming up. And that's it. We're empty. Oh, well, forgot. My badge for church for my ministry team. I'm a, I'm a hostess with the mostest so this is my badge that i wear every third sunday because i serve usually on the third sunday of every like on the third sunday of every month usually um yeah and that's it oh i have a bobby pin you always need a bobby pin on deck but that's it nothing else in here and that's my bag let me show y'all all this junk all of this junk oh my gosh all of this junk in my bag <laughs> but it's necessary my ladies my ladies who carry a big bag and always has everything your friend your cousin your sister anybody need it like yo you got this yo you got this i got you give me a second let me go on my bag <laughs> you know what i'm missing that i always have though like always have gum and the only reason i'm missing it is because i ate the last piece today so i'll re-up tomorrow but that's what's in my bag y'all so I feel like y'all know me a little bit more because y'all know my bag. Like if you didn't know I was a hot sauce person and I'm a diehard hot sauce person and I'm a Texas Pete diehard, you know now. If you didn't know like I was a clean freak with like washing my hands, you know now. I have my hand sanitizer, I keep lotion and I am obsessed with lip glosses and keeping my lips moisturized. So if ever you don't see them moisturized, I'm having a day. Because <laughs> if it's not lip gloss, it's chapstick. It's something that is, I have on my lips keeping them moisturized. What else should you guys know? Should you guys know that I'm a, I pick my teeth? Like, I'm a freak with that. And that's something a lot of people don't know unless you're around me. I pick my teeth, honey, after I eat. And it's like, I don't know if that's not, like, good manners. If you're at the table and you eat and, like, everyone's just, like, kind of, like, done and chit-chatting and you pick your teeth. Let me know. Comment down below. Is that not, like, good mannerism? Should I not, like, floss my teeth? Should I go in the bathroom? Now that I say it out loud, like, I feel like maybe I should. But I'm like... I might not want to go to the bathroom. I might not just pick my teeth. Okay, that's neither here nor there. <clears throat> um, you know I'm a journal person. I have two journals in my purse for no reason. And that might be another reason why my bag is heavy. Unnecessary. Yeah, so that's it. And you guys know I'm a big bag person now. Like, like I like big bags. Like, I'm a tote person. I need a bag that has some space. Okay. Alright. Thank you guys for tuning in. 
Make sure you press the real subscribe button down below. Make sure you subscribe and you press the post notification so you know every time I drop a video. I've been dropping two videos a week, so I hope you guys are keeping up. I hope you guys are loving the content. And if you have any ideas or something you wanna know, make sure you comment down below. I already have some lined up that people have been requesting and writing me on Instagram. So make sure you follow me on Instagram. The information will be down below. I'll also put it on the screen. I love you guys so much. Remember to be the light wherever you go because wherever you go, the light shall follow.